Hello, it's me, Vicky, again. Hola, soy yo, Vicky, otra vez. This is just a quick video just to remind you uh, as uh, the dreaded C word approaches, in other words, Christmas. I don't really like even mentioning the word Christmas before December, but I know a lot of you like to get organised uh, before and not that long to go now. I think we're all perhaps looking forward to Christmas a little bit more this year because uh, of the improvements, if you like, in the COVID situation. So hopefully we can have a more normal Christmas this year uh, than the previous couple of years, whatever that is. Okay, so I just wanted to remind you because good stocking fillers um, for a, a lot of you know about my Break the Language Barrier books, either to learn English or Spanish. Um, but also, of course, I, 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 every now and again, I think I should remind people that I do have these bilingual storybooks, which uh, are good for children or adults. Um, and, you know, for anyone who's learning Spanish, they're just little stories about dogs, um, and you have English and Spanish. So you have the story in English alongside, have the story in Spanish, some pictures. Um, and they're just nice uh, to read uh, if you're, if, if for somebody who's studying Spanish because you can see the English and Spanish alongside each other. So I have uh, three, three books. We have um, Princess Tia's Great Adventure or in Spanish, La Gran Aventura de la Princesa um, Tia. And that is a story about a German Shepherd. We have story of uh, three other dogs, um, Duque el Rey y Peter el Tonto se van de vacaciones, uh, which is uh, Duque the King and, P and Silly Peter go on holiday. Again, they're just little stories. Um, it, they're silly stories, I suppose, really, about animals, but um, the point is not the story, of course. The point is the Spanish and the English. So you can read them out to your children in English or Spanish. They can uh, read them themselves if they're old enough to read. Or, you know, it doesn't even, you don't even have to have a child to, do, to get something out of them, to read them, to follow them. Because you have the English right there and the Spanish there. So, yes, yeah, something might be a nice little stocking filler for Christmas for the children, grandchildren, etc. Or for you. Okay, so that's it. Just a short video just to uh, remind you of them. And I will see you real soon in the next video. Te veo muy pronto en el próximo video. And may your God go with you. Y que tu Dios vaya contigo. Thank you.